but from which countries the other people come from? Mm. <laughs> oh, Emily is from France and Karam is from Turkey. Dima and Alex is from Ukraine. Uh, Vuk is from Slovenia. And Sabina and Clara from Germany. And Shin is from Japan. And Sujang and Mi is from Korea, South Korea. Marisol is <laughs> from Mexico. And Billy was from Greece. Oh, yes, <laughs> Billy was, was from Greece. Yeah, he was. I'm sorry. Uh, what do you participate in a work camp? What do you? Why? Ah, uh, I'm here to have good, ex good life experience, and I wanted, I wanted to meet many foreigner, foreigner people. So that's why I'm here. Uh, because I need a break in my life because. Uh, the economic, which is my major, is very difficult, so I need to break and I have to work to lose my weight, but I fail <laughs> to lose my weight. I gain my weight in here. <laughs> I wanted to learn other way to make work done because I participated in some work camps in France and I was camping there and I was really interested in uh, other way to do, to learn other things and bring it back to France with me. So that's why I'm doing work camps. And also because I know that we have a lot of fun and I can meet other people. Uh, it's, I think it's um, one of the most uh, important experiences in my life because um, it's a good manner to travel around the world sharing ideas with other people from other countries and um, learn a lot of things in everywhere that you go. Because I wanted to learn some new skills, meet some new people and exchange uh, cultural dif differences. Okay. And what are the first three words that come to your mind when you think about the work camp? Wasserwagen, Schubkart. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> beton plat. <laughs> uh, first word is hard working. <laughs> hard working and shovel. <laughs> Shovely. Wow. And uh, many kinds of food of other countries. I think about team spirit, of course, about solidarity and about local people. <laughs> Sharing, learning, and cooking. <laughs> uh, what is special about a work camp for you? Mm, uh, I could learn uh, team spirit. So at first I couldn't. I I can't imagine we can we could make it our work. But through through team spirit we could make it. <laughs> so. Uh, I got to do some stuff that I never thought I would do, so, uh, mar much more manual work than I'm used to, and I got to meet people that I wouldn't get to meet usually, and uh, yeah, like this girl here, <laughs> and I got to see um, that, can I repeat this part? <laughs> A lot of things are really special about the work camp because of uh, all the people who are coming in the same place for a short time. It's never happened in the real life. So work camp is another word for me. <laughs> it's really different than the normal life. Okay. So for me it's just three intensive week where you can have real friendship that you couldn't have in your life. I think there are a lot of uh, things, special things, uh, like um, to meet other people from countries, different countries, um, sharing maybe ideas, uh, manners to do the things, uh, learn about the, the construction. What was your most important experience in this work camp? I don't know all of it. I can't separate anything 
maybe working with the health. <laughs> <laughs> everything is important and everything uh, you can't separate fun part from everything because we, we did some work, we had some fun, we talked, everything is important. The most important experience yeah. I would say meet people. To meet people because uh, there are people from many countries. Um, what did you learn in this work camp? Uh, I learned uh, international relationship between foreigners, their culture, their food, and their thinking, and lots of kind of thing. So sometimes I surprised at their thought, but sometimes it was very good experience. I learned how to shower. <laughs> <laughs> I learned that I can do some manual work even though I didn't think I could. <laughs> I learned to use many instruments that I didn't know how to use. I got to learn a lot about other cultures and um, that's it. Uh, I like so much to be precise in my job. I love that kind of things and uh, Maybe in my job, in my real job, it's not necessary to be so precise because I do different kind of things. And um, here, uh, two millimeters are two millimeters, and <laughs> those are very important. <laughs> I like so much. And what do you get out of the weekend for your personal? Um, I think to be tolerant with the people because I have my own way to do the things, to prepare food, to prepare the things in the, at home and uh, here it's very different, the manner, the hours to, to have dinner, to have lunch and it was so difficult for me uh, get used the uh, hours to it. What do you get out of the work camp? The whole experience. You get out uh, with some new knowledge, you get out with some new cultural experience, you get out with, with, with what is most important, with new friends. Uh, which <laughs> are the differences between the cultures for you? Differences. Mm, uh, there were many kinds of difference. Mm, for example, uh, ah, when when I go to sleep, we don't use ah, we don't use our shoes, but we you sh we should take off our shoes. But it was different, mm. and mm, I think neighborhood in neighborhood between ah. A friendship between neighborhood is very strong. I think so. I envy them. Uh, I think Korea is very close culture, but another country is very open culture. So I think the other countries are very similar, but the only Korea is very different from another culture. <laughs> yeah. Can you give some examples? About difference of the culture? Oh, I told you that they take Depends. their clothes in front of someone. Okay. I can't imagine in Korea. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, there's not many differences between most of the European cultures, some small, but there's huge difference between our culture and uh, Korean culture. They're more, uh, let's say, shy about things that they're, they're not so open and they find it strange that we're so, so uh, out there and we say what's on our mind. There are really a lot of difference um, and even small differences between the cultures but I don't think that it's really between country cultures. I saw a lot of difference between people cultures. I mean we grow in different families and different social uh, surrounding and I think this is make your own culture so of course there is some difference between 
Asia and Europe and America, but that's not so important. Those differences are just around food and clothes and things like that. But the little differences, the most important are just the ones that we don't see at first and that we learn in this And way. the last question is, how do you get to know a country in a work camp compared to a normal holiday? <laughs> the biggest difference is that here you learn a lot of things about how do the people live in one country. If you travel alone, you just go with the guide and just look at the biggest thing you know, that everybody knows. But here, you have the local people who come to you and write you, show you how they make food, how they live in the, the quotidian life. And this is really important. You meet people and you share with these people. I never done that in my normal vacation. As I told you, uh, I met many kinds of friends and many neighborhoods around this countryside. So we usually, I usually spend much time in the city. So I think countryside is better. Mm. So, mm. so. <laughs> well, it's really different. I don't know where to start, but uh, you get to see, we got to see how German people live because we had some uh, really nice, nice hosts and they got to show us the German way of living, which you can't get when you usually go on a holiday. And you get to meet people from other countries and they say this is like this in our country, it's so different than, than in our country, so it's not just experience about Germany, it's also about the other countries.